we're now going to discuss a little bit of the subject of graduating from LaGuardia. If you're in LIV 200, it means that you've created, uh, presumably finished most of the requirements in order to get your degree, and you'll be graduating soon. But many students don't graduate, and it's a big question as to why. What can we do to help students finish and do better? So you're going to be doing some reading of a report that has some ideas about what the problem is and what some of the solutions might be. You might disagree with some of those suggestions. You might agree with them. But as you read through that report and you investigate this question, think about what happened for you and what it's going to take for you to graduate and what advice you might give other students. To give you some perspective from LaGuardia's standpoint, can show you some of the data that we actually have for LaGuardia. This is an interesting chart that looks at people entering LaGuardia, so going all the way back to 2011 and ending at 2020, um, because the data was collected uh, in last year, which was the 2021, 2022 year. So we only go back to 2020 here, just to looking at how many students graduate year by year. And you can see that as you go back in time, we have graduation rates from 2011 that approach 34%. And we have graduation rates that are improving really all the way up until about the pandemic hits. Uh, and people in 2018, 2019 would have been finishing right about the time the pandemic hit. And the graduation rates seem to have dropped a little bit in comparison to the previous years. That's somewhat understandable. It's been much harder to take classes now than it was in the past. But, well, we still have many years in the future to look and see what the outcomes will ultimately be. So we don't really know what it will look like, but this is a very interesting thing for us to consider. And especially to ask students like you, what you think, because you are the students that are going to be in that percentage that graduates. And that's really exciting. So think about this as you go through it, as you read and do a wonderful response, discuss this with your colleagues in the class, the other students, and hopefully this will inform some of the work you do for LIB 200.